What's going on YouTube? As you can see in the title, I'm going to be talking about my addictions. And yes, I am literally addicted and this goes way back into the past. A lot of you guys know I miss X Games. It's literally the worst thing ever. I feel so demoralized that I didn't go. But that should be fire and motivation for the next event and the next event and to make it to Season 3 playoffs. Wow, playing some Skyrise. First game ever on and somehow gets on Skyrise. If you guys saw my competitive Skyrise video, it literally took me almost 30 minutes to get in a Skyrise game. And when I did, it was halfway done already. So these past couple of days, you know, I've just been relaxing. Ace to left for the weekend and teams aren't really playing, obviously, because they're all at freaking X Games. So I've been just chilling. I, I played a little bit, but now I'm just relaxing. You know, I'm trying to enjoy my free time, get a lot of stuff done. You know, I'm going to the doctor, fixing the car up, going to the gym every day. You know, it's, dude's doing my things, all the errands. But one thing I have been doing a lot, a lot, I mean, is playing a PC games. Now, when I'm talking about PC games, I'm talking about League of Legends and Diablo 3. You know, I'm just resting right now, easing my mind. I know the grind, you should always grind. But, you know, I've been playing my... For years and years of Call of Duty, I barely ever have like huge breaks. So this time I have like a four day break and I'm just making the best of it, you know, letting myself rest because I know the grind's about to be real. So how many people here like League of Legends? Raise your hand. So seriously guys, I'm gonna go a little bit back into my history so you guys kind of understand. I used to be a Dota 1, well, a Dota player. If, I, if you guys don't know what Dota is, I mean, I'm pretty sure a lot of you guys playing League of Legends know what Dota 2 is, but Dota 1, was basically on a Warcraft 3 game and it was it was like um what's it called like a mini game type of thing but my god it blew up and my god was it amazing I was really addicted to the game to the point where I would play hours and hours and hours you know I would go to sleep at like 3 o'clock in the morning 4 o'clock in the morning and I had school the next day you know I would have to wake up at 6 I would go to school dead tired you know the first class I would go into head down I'm already trying to sleep it was that bad. But you know, I had love for the game. What can I say? I really enjoyed it. It was so fun for me and I loved I loved everything about it. So League of Legends is pretty much a remake of it and I definitely enjoyed it. At first it was kind of weird, but you know, I still love that game. I got pretty addicted. You know, I was a Call of Duty player, but I would still play that game often. I would play it a lot. And the highest I ever got to was Platinum 1, but you know, in the rank system. But I, I ended up quitting, but I got there up pretty high. I was almost a diamond. And this was back then when it was hard to become a a diamond I guess or a challenger because this was like two years ago now I feel like it's pretty easy to rank up and you see you see a lot of people almost everyone I know is like yeah I'm a find them oh yeah I'm a diamond and then oh I'm a challenger like but yeah guys I was really good at that game and it's a game I really enjoyed playing and I got I got pretty addicted to it at a certain point and the whole thing is I don't know I'm really good at every game I almost play as long as I put in some time and as long as I you know I'm a really fast learner I've always believed that and I, and I am trust me now for the people who played Diablo 2 before raise your hand that was another game that I was really addicted to and it was probably worse than Dota or League of Legends it was bad I mean bad to the point where if I need to use the bathroom I ain't going to go use the bathroom I mean bad to the point where I wasn't even gonna eat I'd rather stay there and play and play and play and play if I needed to do homework the homework ain't gonna be done Kill them without looking. That game was amazing, guys. It's really old, so a lot of you guys probably have never played it, uh, depending how old you guys are. But the game came out in 2001, I believe, and it was really old. The graphics were, I think they're, they're definitely better in RuneScape, but you know they didn't have, they don't, they don't have the best graphics either. But this game was so fun, and I love the PvP. You know, playing other people, and it's just like an all-out brawl. Whoever has the best character wins, type of thing. And I had so much fun with that. On top of that, there was tons of build for each character, which made it so much more fun. And I loved it, man. I loved it. Either way, I got on it really late because the game came out, like I said, in 2001. You know, I played it at a friend's house a couple times in like 2005, 2006, or something like that. And I never really had the game myself. Uh, but long story short, and around 2011, 12, I believe. I, I would say like 11. I ended up getting the game. Uh, you know, because I remember how fun it was. I remember how much I loved it, even though I never really owned it. My brother did. And I I bought it, and I just fell in love. I was addicted. I was playing every day for hours and hours and hours. And I was just about that grind. I was the type of person that would play hours and hours and hours. Just like Dodo, where I said I was playing eight hours a day, you know, constantly grinding. It was the same thing. But this was worse. I was playing 10, 10 to 12 hours. I would literally play from like 3 o'clock in the afternoon and play till like four, 4 or 5 in the morning and my mom would get so pissed because I was like 15, 16 I would have school the next day or during summer I was grinding 
And, you know, I, I, it was really bad. I'm not gonna lie. I was literally addicted. Like, I needed help. Well, the whole thing now is, guys, I'm playing Diablo 3. I love that game. I used to, I played it at the start. Uh, it's, it's not the same as Diablo 2. I really love Diablo 2 a lot more. But they fixed it a little bit. So I've been playing it the past couple days and I'm getting addicted again. But I'm enjoying it. I'm having fun. You know, the patches and everything fixed it up a little bit. And now that's my new addiction. But once uh, my team comes back, once everybody's ready to play, you know, that's going to be my my first thing to do. You know, we're going to start grinding again. I'm going to start playing a lot. But for now, I'm just having fun, enjoying some free time, and just relaxing before the grind really starts. Diablo 3 is a new game I'm addicted to. You know, I'm playing, I'm constantly playing. Every time I go out, every time I'm doing something, I just want to keep playing. It's in my head, like, I can't wait to go home and play. But then there's times where I can't do that. But either way, you know, I'm addicted. And like I said, once my team comes back, it's going to be about that grind. But I hope you guys like this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. This has been your boy, Apathy, and I'm out. Before I go, I just want to say, and I'm serious, work hard. Work for what you want to do, what you want to be. You know, if you're trying to be a millionaire, if you're trying to be a billionaire, if you're trying to be the strongest man on earth, if you're trying to be ripped with APAC and his muscles like blowing up your arms, you could do that as long as you set your mind to it. Mind over matter is the one thing I also believe in. And that is going to take you far far you hear me so make sure you do that make sure you work hard for you want to be don't let anyone say you can't do it because you can if somebody tells you your mom 